After repeated tests, North Korea hasn't launched a missile in 56 days. What's going on? Though President Donald Trump is on a high profile visit to Asia this week, North Korea has refrained from testing another ballistic missile or nuclear bomb, making this the longest stretch of time since Trump took office that the regime has not conducted a test. Is it a sign the administration's approach to North Korea is working, even as Washington and Pyongyang continue to exchange volleys in a war of words? North Korea tested its first missile just 22 days after Trump was inaugurated on January 20. From March to May, the regime conducted tests every one to two weeks. It has been 56 days since North Korea's last test of a ballistic missile, an intermediate range KN 17, that flew over the Japanese island of Hokkaido. As Trump has made his way through South Korea, Japan, and China this week, touting the strength of U.S. alliances and commanding North Korea to not try us, the regime has remained quiet. In his address to the South Korean National Assembly this week, Trump directly addressed North Korean leader Kim Jong-un, telling him his weapons are putting his country in grave danger. North Korea is not the paradise your grandfather envisioned. It is a hell that no person deserves, Trump said. Shortly after that speech, North Korean officials told CNN, we don't care about what that mad dog may utter, referring to Trump. Dot dot it's a continuation of the war of words, even as the regime's missile tests have noticeably paused, a surprising development, given that North Korea has often followed verbal sparring with threats and missile tests. Dot dot on August 8, Trump threatened the regime with fire and fury like the world has never seen, leading Kim to say he would consider sending missiles into the waters off the coast of Guam in mid-August. Dot dot several weeks later, North Korea fired three short-range ballistic missiles not toward Guam, but into the Sea of Japan. Dot dot in other instances, tests have followed high-profile visits from U.S. officials. Dot dot in March the regime tested mobile-launched missiles a week after Secretary of State Rex Tillerson's trip to Asia. In April the North tested a KN-17 missile as Vice President Mike Pence was en route to South Korea. Dot dot but there was no test when Secretary of Defense James Mattis traveled through Asia at end of October and on during Trump's current trip, so far. Dot dot Jenny Town, the managing editor of 38 North.